China, known for its industrial prowess and ability to excel across multiple sectors, has introduced another groundbreaking technology in the automotive industry. Xiaomi, a leading technology manufacturer renowned for its smartphones, computers, electronics, and home appliances, has made a surprising foray into the larger automotive landscape. With ambitions to rival established giants such as Porsche, Tesla, and Maserati, Xiaomi recently unveiled its ambitious entry into the auto industry. The company's initial triumph comes in the form of the Xiaomi Su-7, a battery electric vehicle. Welcome to Tesla Global, let's get into the video. Impressively, Xiaomi received over 50,000 orders within just 27 minutes of the Su-7 debut, a number that surged to over 75,000 within the first month. This rapid surge in demand prompted the introduction of innovative manufacturing technologies to fulfill delivery commitments. Xiaomi's new technology aims to ensure the fulfillment of their goal to deliver 100,000 units of the Xiaomi Su-7 within the year, showcasing Xiaomi's ability to scale operations efficiently and meet market demands, thereby reinforcing its competitive edge in the automotive industry. Currently, 578 Xiaomi Su-7S have been delivered in China, with plans for further market expansion underway. Xiaomi aims to deliver another 10,000 Su-7S by June, positioning itself for tough competition with established manufacturers like Tesla. If you're enjoying the video, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to the channel. Tesla, known for its gigacasting technology, employs machines to inject molten metal into molds at high temperatures, creating large aluminum parts for their vehicle frameworks. Xiaomi is pioneering innovation by combining two production methods, Tesla's G-casting and stamping to manufacture the Xiaomi Su-7. Xiaomi asserts itself as the only local car manufacturer utilizing both self-developed die-cast alloy materials and a self-developed large die-casting equipment cluster system. This dual approach aims to enhance production efficiency and meet high demand. Tesla pioneered large-scale die-casting, amalgamating multiple parts into a single larger component which reduces factory space, enhances car safety by increasing rigidity, and lightens the car, thereby improving its range. This machine revolutionizes the production of the rear floor assembly for the Xiaomi Su-7. What do you think to this info and news? Previously requiring 72 separate parts to be stamped and welded, it can now be created as a single part in just 100 seconds. This innovation reduces welding points by 840 and cuts production time by 45% for the Su-7. This means a 17% reduction in weight and a 2 decibel decrease in road noise. Additionally, the new integrated floor panel has a life expectancy of over 2 million kilometers, more than 10 times that of traditional panels. Xiaomi has addressed a major criticism of such manufacturing, the expense of replacing damaged parts. Subscribe to Tesla Global. They have implemented a three-stage anti-collision design so that in low and medium speed collisions, only the anti-collision beam and crumple zone need replacement. The factory with high automation can produce 40 cars an hour or one every 76 seconds, featuring over 700 robots and 181 autonomous mobile robot, ANR, units for delivering stamped parts. Each ANR uses LiDAR for navigation. Machines also handle quality inspection, with the Edifin system achieving 99.99% accuracy in defect detection. A common criticism of such manufacturing methods is the high cost of replacing parts if they are damaged. During the test drive, he was only allowed to ride in the back seat of the Xiaomi Su-7 rather than taking control of the steering wheel as usual. A representative from Xiaomi explained that this decision stemmed from recent crashes involving the Xiaomi Su-7. The automaker prefers individuals with more years of driving experience to handle the powerful electric car. For those who are able to test, drive the Xiaomi Su-7, their experiences confirmed what had been circulating in the media 
in recent weeks. One test driver mentioned expecting a compact car akin to the Porsche Taycan. However, upon experiencing the Su-7 driving around the resort, they were surprised to find it larger than anticipated. Its design echoes elements of the Mazda RX-7 FD, particularly noticeable in its long bonnet. Unlike some newer electric vehicles that feature hidden door handles, the Su-7 opts for semi-concealed handles with concealed buttons for door access. The side profile bears resemblance to the Porsche Taycan, but with slightly smaller and less rounded fenders. At the rear, the car showcases a continuous taillight design and an electronic spoiler. The paint finish exhibits a high level of polish even under indoor lighting conditions such as parking lots. The specific model under discussion is the top trim Xiaomi Su 7 Max Founders Edition, the sole one in the market, priced at $41,600. Local buyers should anticipate additional costs beyond this base price. Upon entering the Xiaomi Su 7, the sporty ambience becomes immediately evident, a distinguishing feature among B Class sedans within this price bracket. The cockpit impresses with its sophisticated blend of Nappa leather, suede, and soft touch materials. The seating position sits low, providing exceptional visibility for the driver. Hidden under the center console for emergencies is a torch, a thoughtful addition to the Xiaomi Su 7's array of features. The vehicle boasts a substantial 16.1 inch screen with 3K resolution operable through voice commands. Powering this screen, is a Qualcomm Snapdragon 8295 system on chip with Hyperus software. Rear passengers will find ample space in the Xiaomi Su 7 with generous headroom and leg space. However, the rear seat's lower hip point might make sitting upright less comfortable. Rear amenities include two air vents, USB ports, and a cooler under the air vents capable of holding six cans of soft drinks. Additionally, the Su-7 boasts a spacious frunk. Upon starting the car, the LCD panel above the steering wheel rotates, indicating readiness and displaying the selected driving mode. Xiaomi has also included a beginner mode for first-time drivers, accessible via a toggle at the lower right of the steering wheel. Powered by a 101 kWh battery from KTL, the Su-7 Max offers a driving range of 497 miles under the CC cycle. This is epic news. It supports 800 volt fast charging, enabling the battery to charge from 20% to 80% in around 30 minutes using a high power DC charger. This blend of performance and efficiency sets the Xiaomi Su 7 Max apart in its class. Despite the impressive features of the Xiaomi Su 7, challenges have been reported by some owners. Why not leave a like on the video and let me know in the comments your thoughts on the news. As we wrap up, let's take a look at one real-life experience with the Xiaomi Su 7. A Sky Blue Su 7 owner recorded a video showcasing the car breaking down after just 24 miles on the road. Despite assurances that the vehicle would undergo complete restoration at the factory, tensions arose when the owner requested a brand new car as a replacement. However, Due to allocation constraints where cars produced are already assigned to other buyers, obtaining a new replacement proved to be a challenge. Reports indicate that Xiaomi is working diligently to offer a complete refund for the faulty Su-7 and cover any associated expenses. Remember, if you found this video informative, don't forget to like and subscribe to Tesla Global for more updates on electric vehicles and automotive technology. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.